about as complete an effort as this year, would you say? You know what's funny? <laughs> um, I would actually say that, you know, some of our performances on the road during this road trip, um, specifically the Red Bull game, I, I thought our performance was maybe a little bit more complete. I, I thought we played a pretty good 90 minutes there and we just came out on the wrong end of a result. But I thought tonight, you know, unbelievable second half. I mean, the first half, it wasn't perfect from us. Uh, I think we created some pretty good chances, but we didn't have uh, we didn't have possession. And I thought we allowed them to dictate a little bit too much of the game. I thought we once we won the ball back, we gave it away way too easily. We were rushing things. Uh, we didn't have much composure going forward. It seemed like every time we won the ball, uh, the first pass was either going out of bounds or going to a different team, or we were trying to go score within one or two passes. And, that's frustrating because you don't get a rhythm. And then Seattle's a really good team, and they start popping the ball around in the midfield and creating chances, and you're just kind of chasing shadows there. So I'd say no. Uh, it wasn't the most complete performance, but I'd say probably the second half. You know, you'd have to say probably the best half of the season. Um, really proud of the guys, and, and you know, it, it would have been easy to come back down, heads down in the locker room after Seattle played well in the first half. But uh, I thought we fought well and, and got a deserved win. So despite the laps at a scoreline, plenty of teachable moments. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, let's be honest. Um, you know, we were we were on the end of some fortunate decisions tonight. And uh, with that being said, um, we've been on the, the end of some unfortunate decisions. Uh, so at the end of the day, I'm a firm believer that all these calls even out throughout the year. And so tonight, uh, you know, we obviously had uh, uh, some good fortune come our way. Um, I thought, you know, Seattle up until the second goal, they they did everything that a championship does, championship team does. They 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 pressed us, they created chances. It was a good battle in the midfield. Um, they kept the ball pretty well. So after we got the second goal, I think you saw our confidence just grow. And uh, I think once we realized that, you know, hey, we we deserve to be here, uh, we deserve to be out on the field with the the champions. Um, you know, we started to take it to them, and that was a good feeling. Yeah, kind of. You know, you talked about that when you came here as this team, you know, learning how to win and learning how to not be in last place. Yep. You know, is that second half, you know, coming back after giving up the tying goal, is that the kind of thing that you were talking about? Sure, yeah. I mean, these are, uh, these are big games for the club. I mean, national television, uh, sellout crowd, um, you know, bright lights, night game. These are games that players should dream of, and these are games that you should thrive in. You know, you should really want to play in these big games. And uh, like I said, after the first half, I, I thought we were pretty dangerous. I mean, we created some good chances on the break, but we didn't play that well. And uh, we came in the locker room, we regrouped, we changed a couple things, and you know, we came out and, and we showed character. You know, we showed a little bit of attitude, and uh, and that was something that I think this team needs to get better at. You know, we need to continue. And, and if we would have come out of the locker room against LA and played like we did in the second half tonight against LA, we, we would be walking off that field in LA with three points and feeling pretty good about ourselves right now. So we still have a long way to go, uh, no question about it. Like I said, I mean, uh, we're, we're still learning. We're still learning on the fly how to win. And uh, that's something that only comes with uh, going through tough games like tonight. Were you worried at all when they equalized so quick? No, I mean, you, you're obviously frustrated because, uh, you know, we talked about that. They, Seattle loves to overload the midfield. They have three or four guys constantly buzzing around the middle of the field, and they're all really good, dangerous players. And so to lose Clint Dempsey uh, like that is unacceptable. I mean, the guy is deadly. He's one of the most deadly finishers in the game. And you lose him like that, uh, it's, it's, it's uh, frustrating because that's a goal that shouldn't be given up. But we regrouped, like I said, in the second half, made it to halftime to make some adjustments, and came out in the second half and played well. I thought everyone on the field uh, for the most part in the second half, won their individual battles. And when you have guys step on the field that, that aren't scared and guys win their individual battles, you're going to have a good day, and that's what happened.